I don't know who needs to hear this, but I can't emphasize this enough. You cannot control when it's going to happen for you. Whatever the it is for you, you can't control when it's going to happen. Now, you can create the illusion that it's already happened. I see it all the time with people. They haven't necessarily reached the height of their potential, and yet they create or fabricate a reality where they're constantly busy. But that's not, that doesn't mean that it's actually happened. It means that they're still myopic in their view, in their viewpoint. So remember, the universe is really taking care of you if it hasn't happened for you yet. So don't be in a hurry. Don't be too pressed for change. All right. You might think you want something right now, but what you're tapping into is a feeling that corresponds to a future reality that isn't supposed to happen right now. So let me give you an example of this. Let's imagine that Oprah was too eager to get it going when she was young. Then she might have made something happen, but she wouldn't have become Oprah. So you have to follow the universal timing of this. There is a process and there's an intelligence backing that process, you see. So don't be in a hurry to make things happen. Instead, feel what's coming up for you. Because when you feel what's coming up for you, you're transforming yourself from the inside out. You're, you're making room or you're creating space for the universe to work through you to make it happen on its time, not on your schedule, you see. And so feeling is the great transformer. It, it prepares you for what you really want that you may not know that you want. So often we're too eager and we lack patience. And then, yeah, you make something happen, but is it the highest, highest possibility? No. So just trust that if, let's say, a guy isn't calling you back, it's for your good. Just trust that if your purpose hasn't been revealed to you in life yet, it's for your good. We have to implicitly trust the forces of the universe now more than ever. And if you're too eager and you're too impatient, you're not going to make it to the top of that mountain. You're not. Whatever that mountain is for you, your highest potential. So just keep that in mind, my friends. The universe is looking out for you in ways that you can't even possibly fathom. So just be patient with the process. If there seems to be blockages in your way right now, boulders in your way right now, consider it a gift from the universe. It's simply looking out for you. And everything will happen for you in perfect time. I love you.